Hi guys, it's Marco here, Fully Loaded Cars. Hope you're all keeping well. In today's Rover P2 video, we'll be showing you how we're gonna make the rear inner panels uh, for this section here. The uh, reason we make a new ones of these is because obviously we've got new quarters and they're completely different shape. And because the fuel filler pipe is completely different now. This is the one we made in the last video, so if you haven't seen it, check that out. And uh, we'll be doing some heat shrinking first on the panel, because the panel's deformed since we've welded that section in here. So we'll be heat shrinking uh, this panel first, and then after that, Laszlo will uh, just clean up the welds and primer inside before we weld these panels in. So yeah, hope you enjoy the video and uh, see you in a bit. This is to cover this section here. So as you can see, there's a large opening here. We needed this large opening to be able to put the fuel neck around this. So the original panel used to go like this and now the fuel neck hits it. So we've obviously we've got to block all these holes off and reinforce it. So this is the first panel, this panel, goes on here, I'll go and get the other one. So this is, that's the template and this is the one we made. So this will get welded into place. This will get bonded along here. Before we weld it, it will all be primed. So yeah, this is the first one. The next one I'll make will be the upper one. So this is the first one and we've got This one here. So this is the next one we'll be making.
so we've now got both upper panels made. So this one goes like that. That's going to get welded into there. This one will be welded into there. So that's the upper panels. You might be asking why are we making it in two separate panels and why is there such a big gap? Well, the central locking relay for the petrol flap will go here. And we also need space to put feed the, the filler neck in when we're mounting it. So that's why we're doing it like this. Next panel will be this one that goes along here. That will that will cover the majority of it. This one's going to be a bit more complex. These two were just simple hammer and dolly. This panel we'll be using some more of our other tools that we've got here, like the shrinker and the stretcher and the bender. So yeah, we'll do this one next. is 95% complete. I've just got to put a, an access panel in here for the wiring loom, so I'll make a separate panel and then weld it into this one. i also run this panel for the bead roller to give it some shape. Um, so yeah, that's pretty, pretty much it for this one. That I can't, that I won't, that I fail, that I'll never make it out, yeah 
Please tell me all the bad, never good Fill my head full of every single doubt, yeah Please say any negative thoughts I pop off when I hear people say I cannot I get off to the thought of proving everyone wrong I won't stop to the top, so you better back off I get lost I'ma stay loud, stay proud Never running now, never heading south I'll be spreading out, call it word of mouth Can't put me down, I'll be getting loud You can have me douse, not what I'm about Have your f***ing cloud, it be raining now I keep making sound, go another round Bitch, I'm legend bound, can't stop me now You don't wanna f*** with me A slow burn like a disease Just tell me that I can and I'll show you things That you couldn't believe Just tell me that I can Cause I just wanna hear it out your mouth, yeah Give me fuel, it's a tool that I use To go ahead and run my f***ing mouth, yeah I take shots, I take loss, I make shots, I miss lots I tell you get big boss, you get yachts You swing lots and pop off a big shot I ain't done chasing, got big dreams, bigger things, impatient Who's at the top think they need replacement? Who's at the top think I'm gonna erase that face it? I don't give up quick, I don't give up I won't give up this So, as you can see, the inner panel is now finished. This was the hardest panel we had to make in this video. So that's all done. We added this section in here, put it on the plumishing hammer and gave it that shape. So this is all ready for primer. Uh, so that's this video. In the next video, we'll be showing you uh, the underside here. We've got to close this gap up here. Uh, we need to put a tray for the air compressor that's gonna go in there. So that's for the next video. So feel free to subscribe, like, and comment, and we'll catch you in the next video.